Hey guys, this is Kristen HK Wax Center. Um, I'm finally gonna show you guys how I clean my wax pots. I'm so sorry this video is way long overdue. I've had so many of y'all asking me how I do it and um, and I'll respond, but I've been telling y'all I'd make a video and I just haven't, honestly, I keep forgetting. So I'm finally gonna do it for you, <laughs> finally. Um, now, you'll need a couple things. One, um, if you have excess wax on your pot, um, like a, either a little, popsicle stick or a tongue depressor or something like that um and then a paper towel and alcohol those are my three main things sometimes i'll use like my pre-wax cleanser but honestly normally alcohol does the trick so i'll move my camera here so that you can actually see my pot now it's funny um i don't i'm just normally not one to get my wax pot super messy um now i for this video after today it just i didn't think it'd be impressive enough so i have uh made my wax pot super messy for you guys so hopefully um this is enough to show you how i do it again normally it doesn't look this bad but i wanted to actually show you a big difference between um between a clean pot and a dirty pot so first thing i'll do with all of this excess wax that i have so lovely placed on my pot um i'll take like i said a little popsicle stick um and clean that off so i'll just take it here and pull the wax off just like that. It just helps make it easier um, to clean the wax pot. If I'm gonna try to get all this off with just alcohol, that's just gonna be a lot more work than I actually really need. So again, take this here and I will just push until I get that off, at least the majority of it. Then I'll turn it and do this side, just pushing down, trying to pull up as much as possible. And then this last little bit right there there we go okay as you can see um it already looks so much better than what it did before now i will just take a paper towel like this and i'll fold it a couple times that way since the wax pot is hot um i won't burn myself so I'll turn it up. Uh, it's not too turned up right now because I still need to use it. Um, but normally I'll turn it way up. Just it makes it a lot easier to get the melted wax off. And then I'll take my alcohol like that. And I'm going to soak it. I'm going to do it over my sink here. That way I don't get alcohol all over the place. Um, but then I'll just start rubbing. Really easy. Just rub like that. You can see the wax pretty easily just comes off. Again, if you try to do this when your wax pot is not hot, it's gonna be a nightmare. So turn your wax pot up as high as it can go. Make sure the wax is starting to melt when you do that and then just start rubbing. Super easy, just like that. Now some wax pots will come with a lip what I mean by that is mine is just a flat surface, but some of them will have like a little divot. So whenever you put the lid on top of it, wax will get stuck in there and it'll get stuck to your lid. Um, if you were to have something like that, then I would just take the um, paper towel and a little tongue depressor like this, stick the tongue depressor in the paper towel. Hopefully y'all can see this. Oh. Get on here. <laughs> Stick the tongue depressor in the paper towel so it gives you like a nice hard edge, and then stick it in that uh, little crevice, and then just push. That will help get all of that wax out of that little crevice there, so you have a nice clean pot. Um, but like I said, sometimes I'll use a little bit of cleanser. Um, most of the time, I don't. But if for some reason I really feel like I need to, then I will. Um, but that's really worked for me. Hopefully it works for you guys. It's super easy as long as you know how to do it. I do this every day after my clients. That way everything is nice and sanitary. If you don't want your client coming in here and seeing you have a disgusting pot, it's going to give them the wrong impress uh, impression. Um, they're going to think that you're not a sanitary um, business owner. Just clean your pots. It looks so much better, a clean pot compared to a dirty pot. So clean your pots. Um, any questions, let me know. Phone number here, if I went to at 501-2767. Don't forget to like and subscribe. If you have any questions, let me know. Just drop a comment. I'm always happy to answer them for you guys, but have a good rest of your day. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.